Hi, this is Transition Pack 60 tutorial. In this tutorial, I will explain how we can use this transition inside Premiere. So, first of all, let's open this project. In After Effects, File, Open Project, and select Transition 60. Hit Open. Inside Project Panel, open Transition Colorful Shape Opener folder. All of these are transition compositions, 60 of them. I will select the first shape transition one, double click to open. Now when I move to the timeline, you can see the transition. To change the color, select the blue colored layer, go to this fill option and click on the color and change to a different one. Move forward a little bit more, select the second color and change to a different one. After done with the editing, go to composition, add to render queue and in output module click on lossless, select a format and in video output make sure in channels RGB plus alpha is selected. Hit OK. Then in Output 2, give a name and render. This is the first method. So this one can be used as a video inside Premiere. The second method is go to Premiere, already placed two images inside the timeline. Now go to File, Adobe Dynamic Link import after effects composition we will select the train same transition as you can see here inside the composition you will find the same folders and composition which is inside after effects go to the transition colorful shape opener folder open it We'll use the same one which we edited inside After Effects, Shape Transition 1, hit OK. Now the transition is inside Premiere. When I move the cursor, you can see that how the transition is animated. Now I will select it, drag and drop on top of our video clip. Now make sure the cut is exactly when the color fills the whole screen. So I will move it to the edit. This is how we can use this transition inside Premiere. Second method. This is more much better than the first method because if I am changing or editing the transition here for instance if I am change the color here and save it it will be automatically updated inside Premiere so these are the two methods to use this transition inside Premiere I hope this tutorial helps and if you have any further questions please let me know. Thank you for watching. Take care.